Hi, my name is Aoife Gorman and I'm from Kokomio Bridal. Um, we basically sell bridal dresses and bridesmaid dresses and we've been open just under two years. Location for me is key. Um, I know some bridal stores that are open in um, areas where there's no traffic and I think they struggle to get to football. Um, for us, it works really well. I mean, we've got a bus stop next to us. Bus stops, everyone gets to glare in through the window. Um, and yeah, we're always improving the store as well. So we have a sign going up and out to advertise. We have lighting going in, all extra bits that are going in the end of this month. And yeah, it's, it's everything really, location-wise. My best marketing advice is definitely social media. Um, you have to be on everything, Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. And also Google Plus. A lot of the Welsh people who I've spoken to don't know much about Google Plus, but it drives your website up to the top with the correct hashtags. Um, I would say also marketing is just as important as meeting the brides in here because that's how you communicate with them outside of the shop and that's how you basically want your business to grow and it says a lot about the business if you're not on social media. You also have to have a good website and you have to update it every two weeks. If you don't blog or put anything up, your website's just going to drop. You can't stay on the top of Google. There is a lot of competition in the area, but again, we all have different designers, um, so no one can have the same designer in a 25 mile radius. So when someone goes to another store down the road versus here, you basically, they have completely different dresses. You cannot have the same identical because copyright laws, everything like that. All my designers are based in Barcelona, so we actually go to Barcelona twice a year to choose our dresses. And now we've actually started using Snapchat we're actually going to implement it where we're going to take pictures of the dresses and get our customers to try and give us some insight into which ones they're preferring. It basically gets them involved. At the end of the day, we've got to accommodate our customers. And every customer that comes in here actually becomes a friend. Everybody is in touch all the time. They're always sending us on the lovely professional pictures afterwards. Um, and I'd like to think that if they have any issues, they can pick up the phone and contact me. I also text every bride the night before or two, three days before with my own personal number too, so people can actually contact me direct on my mobile if needs be. I do get people who send me emails and messages at 12 a.m. at night and I do get people who send me at 6 a.m. in the morning, but this is a business and I'm fully committed to the business.